My people, welcome back to the house. It's your boy Till here. And right now we are back on some NBA Live 18 and the coach is checking up on us in the text messages, seeing if our transition into the NBA is okay, seeing if we need anything, and also if we are enjoying ourselves. The good thing is we got some hype and some RP out of it. So make sure you watch those text messages, my people. But also we just signed Monte Ellis out of free agency. So our team is getting even more loaded. Let's get it. I'm starting to believe I made a really good choice coming to the Boston Celtics. We signed Monte Ellis. We got weapons all over the floor. Gordon Hayward driving to the right side. No problem for him. I have a feeling I'm going to come into my own on this team. Especially being a rim protector, I can play my position solely. Getting a block already. No problem. Gordon one time being aggressive at the basket. Yes, indeed. The Timberwolves are really trying to run out here. Okay, they're working the ball around. Lonzo on Cat, I'm there for the help just in case. They're not doing too much of anything. Lonzo getting the rip, going down the side. Is he going to do something special with it? Lonzo ball, no chill. I'm struggling offensively, but defensively as a squad, we're doing really good. Jamal, nah, that's not your shot, my man. It's too much contact for you. Pass it to Lonzo. Let me go ahead and run towards the rim. Oh, yeah. Bane, see me. Why am I catching the ball like that? And I put up a shot, and it was a terrible shot. They are really pushing on offense, not even waiting for their full team. No problem. I'm getting the board almost over the back. I see you, Larkin. Go ahead and finish that at the rim left-handed. Something light. Good defense, Take the ball. The good thing is, being on a team with so many weapons, I don't have to be aggressive offensively. I can take my time and just do my job on the defensive end. Jamal Crawford, that's not your world. Not while I'm in here. Let's run. Lonzo, go ahead and pass it up to me. I'm going up strong. And dang, said no. He's not letting it happen like that. So I may have to force it a little bit here. Gorgie Dang going for the steal on the perimeter? Let's work the moves. He's trying to be a little too aggressive defensively. No, sir, I'm meeting you at the basket. I'm really starting to feel more like a role player on this team. Jamal Crawford trying to create any way he can. No, sir. Lonzo, I see you up the floor. This is his game to flourish. Look at this man up and under. Dr. J style. I'm going to guard the paint. It ain't going to be an issue. We've been doing it well so far. No, sir, not in here, like I said. Let's run. Bane's giving me a good ball. Lonzo, one more time. Go do something with it. With the spin, lay in. No chill. Coach took me out for the majority of the second quarter. I wonder if it's because I wasn't contributing offensively, but defense was there. Oh, yeah, let's get down here then. If that's what he wants, let's be a little bit more aggressive. I'll pass it out. Horford looking at me, mid-range. Can I knock it down one time? Not a strong showing, but we still have the lead at the half. Everybody on the team is really putting up numbers. So let's see if I can get mine in the second half. The Celtics will start the second half with a narrow lead. It was their playmaking, the way they gave each other scoring opportunities. That really impresses me. I love seeing unselfish basketball like that. These are the guys getting buckets for the Boston Celtics. Player of the half. I'm ready to skip ahead and just get this guy player of the game. You can tell he's on his way to a special game. And here we have a look at his stat line. Here's our top plays from the first half. Number two. Number one. 
TD Garden. This second half, we're going to try to be a little bit more aggressive, but not too much, though. So let's see if we can get good position. Roll to the basket, maybe. No, sir. Let's pass that out. Let me reestablish myself down here on the block. Let's work. Power move towards the basket. Left hand hook. Cat ain't ready. Now we're at a point in the game where we're starting to separate just a little bit. Tried to undercut it. Got help coming over the top. Yes, indeed. Let's run. Lonzo's running, Gordon's running, Kyrie, let me get on my side. Cat tried to undercut it. I'm at the rim though, making plays. These T-Wolves are playing fast right now. I wonder if they're gonna play like that this year. Gordon cutting in front, oh yeah, I got the advantage. Let me go ahead and go up strong, slashing at the basket. Give me the and one. Let's see if we can knock down this free throw. That percentage is not good. And I'm getting an early release. Oh, that's all bad. So let's get back, make up for it. 23 is leaking. Jimmy Butler, no sir. I'm there. We got help. Lonzo came over to help your boy out. I appreciate you, my man. Kyrie's up the court by himself. That's a three on one. Oh, yeah, I'm coming back door, though. No problem with the contact. Coach took us out the rest of the third quarter. So you see Minnesota is climbing back into it. Pick and roll. Yes, sir. Couldn't draw it up any better. Now that I'm back in the game, we're going to help aggressively on a lot of people. Taj Gibson isn't going to get busy on my behalf. Oh, yeah. Double team. Let's go ahead and get over there. Al Horford with the steal. Outlet it up to Marcus Smart. Oh, I'm running. I got space on my side. Andrew Wiggins, good Lord. They got Cat pushing it up the floor? No, no, no. I'm going to hold him down on this side. Al Horford getting the pickpocket, no problem. Gordon Hayward, I know you see me. Oh, I'm going to go ahead and force this shot with the contact off the glass. Athletic out here. So, my people, how many of you have actually played NBA Live 18 at this point? What has been your favorite part about it? What archetype did you build? Let's run this pick and roll right now. Let's see if I can get to the basket, something slight, switch back to the other hand, missing the layup. I know I've mentioned this before, but it's an exciting year, the fact that we have two great basketball games that we get to play. I know some people disagree with it, but I've been waiting a long time for us to have some competition and two games we genuinely get to play. Pick and roll. Oh, yeah, I should have finished that at the rim. One thing my coaches always used to say is that competition drives performance. You're going to see games like NBA Live and NBA 2K get better simply because they feel like they're competing against one another. At least you would hope. But I understand that they are two different types of titles, but similar in genre. Hey, let's go ahead and see what happens in the future, my people. We have a 68 to 62 lead. Marcus Smart bringing it up the court. Let's go ahead and work. We got a minute left on the clock. Can we do something special right now? I'm passing it off to Smart. Let's run this pick and roll. Yes, sir. At this corner, I got nothing but space. Sending it in. So it's now towards the end of the game, 4.4 seconds left, and I see Minnesota still trying to press and hope that they can get this W. Let's be a savage about this right now. The Mantle is going down with no chill, dunking it down with 1.2 left. You call a timeout. Today we did not put on a spectacular performance. The Mantle was more defensive than offensive. But that's okay, 72 to 67 is still a good look. We plan on making improvements. Hey, and we're still trying to get our chemistry down with this new team. We got the reward points, we got more hype. 24 points, six boards, four blocks. Really protecting the rim and a 100 performance grade. We also got rank two unlock for our second trade, no foul, and 2400 XP. So we'll get two upgrades 
And as you see, we reached level 43, but this is what our stats are looking like at the moment. We're gonna go ahead and add those two attribute upgrades to post defense. And as you see, it takes two upgrades to upgrade one time. But my people, I appreciate you being here in the house yet again for another NBA Live 18 video. We're improving day by day. And also guys, make sure to hit that like button, subscribe if you are new, and tell me what's been your favorite part about NBA Live 18, and have you been playing it a lot yourself? But anyways, my people, for those of you that have been here, let the new ones know that, hey, we 